Till now, we have seen what is voice. Voice is a verb expresses whether the subject in the sentence has performed or received an action. For example, the watchman opens the door. Here, watchman is the person, uh, subject who has performed the action. And the second example, the door is opened by the watchman. So here, the subject, the door becomes the does not perform anything but is a receiver of an action. We have also seen the rules to convert active to passive voice in simple present tense, simple past tense, present continuous tense and past continuous tense as well as present perfect. Today we are going to learn the next rule, uh, the rule for the changing of active to passive when the sentence in active voice is in past perfect and simple future. So let's begin. Active and passive voice rules for the past perfect. As you all know, the past perfect has the active voice structure of the sentences subject plus had plus v3 form of verb and the object. In negative, it has had not and if it is interrogative, had plus subject. We'll see the examples in the next slide. And in passive voice, now you have already, you know, it might be fixed in your mind key as now. The object takes place in the object comes in the subject's place and subject goes to the object place and we have had plus been the same rule which had applied for present perfect where we had uh, we write has or have been and v3 form of verb here also same thing only we have had uh, had been and v3 form of verb whereas v3 form of verb is already there in active voice and you just need to add been over here b double -E e-n here are some examples. Active voice, Misha had cleaned the floor. Now, the floor comes first. The floor had been cleaned by Misha. Vishal had solved the doubts. The doubts had been solved maybe by Vishal. Had they caught the thief? Had the thief been caught by them? I had paid 50,000. 50,000 had been paid by me. The next rule for active to passive is in simple future. Simple future we always use will, right? So here the structure of the sentence in active voice will be subject will plus v1 verb plus object. Whereas in passive voice, object plus will be and v3 plus uh, v3 followed by by subject. Let's see a few examples of this. Kriya will see the bag. The bag will be sealed by Kriya. Disha will not arrange the things. The things will not be arranged by Disha. Will you mop the floor? Here, if you see active voice, it starts with will you mop the floor. So it ends uh, starts in passive voice also. Will the floor be mopped by you? They will post the letter. The letter will be posted by them. Rina will save money. Money will be saved by Rina. So children remember there is no passive voice formation for these tenses that is present perfect continuous, past perfect continuous, future perfect continuous and future continuous. Now let us summarize. Let's summarize. Here is I have taken only one sentence in all the tenses and you can observe the changes how the sentence changes into passive voice if you observe it very carefully the object which is object in the active voice the shell it comes first in all the sentence and collected by the boy you will find it everywhere in the sentence collected by the boy whether it is simple present present continuous simple past or past continuous or past perfect or even in your simple future collected by the way now you have to remember what changes is only the verb with the auxiliary verb so what is the what changes or what we have to remember is in simple present we use are depending on the noun whether it is singular or plural and when it is ing form of verb in continuous we use are being both in past and future past we use were or was whereas in Perfect, 
we know that uh, present perfect has have been or has been and past perfect remains had been and future will be will be only okay children i hope you have understood and this is an easy trick which i have shown you how to change from active to passive how to remember for this you need to revise the tenses which would be more helpful when you solve the exercises of active to passive thank you children stay safe stay home have a good day